Hi guys, my name is Aaron and today we're going to be taking a look at the Mechanics Original Gloves. Now before I get into this review, if you like what you see, please don't hesitate to click the subscribe button and also the uh, links to my Facebook and Twitter will be up there in the, um, in the annotations as well as in the links below. So, um, starting off, um, these are the original Mechanics Gloves, um, they're in um, the colour which is a uh, coyote brown um, and they are also in size medium. Um, one th quick thing to mention about the sizing, um, I ordered these um, from fastsupport.co.uk for around £18 I believe, that's um, uh, UK currency obviously, um, if you're American then hey, uh, you can get them from uh, a lot more places in the US. Um, but these fit very snugly and there's a reason for that. Um, the, the way these gloves are designed is that they're not designed to keep your hands warm, they're designed to protect your hands from like abrasions and stuff, but also be able to... Um, if you be able to uh, feel whatever you're um, working with, be that a gun or um, uh, working with cars or anything. Um, of course, these are um, called mechanics because they are um, were originally designed for mechanics um, in car um, shops and stuff, working on cars. Um, so, quickly go through some features here. They have um, two-way stretch material, um, which uh, provides really great comfort. Um, you can see that these gloves are actually really thin on the underside. This is really, really, really thin material. Um, and the reason is that, as I said before, so you can feel your, um, the thing you're working with. Um, they also have a TPR, which is thermal plastic rubber, hook and loop closure for a secure fit, um, which is this bit here. Um, comes off really, really nicely. Easy to use, just a bit of Velcro. And then you can use your hands. Um, I'm going to be your hand model today. And you can uh, move your glove on and then secure it with the velcro. As you can see these are really 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 tight to your hand you can see the um, material here um, everything is completely um, flush to your, your hand there's nothing not a lot of material sticking out which is why I recommend you get the right sizing for you these are medium and they're slightly lower cut than you might be used to um, I know gloves sometimes go sort of around past the ankle here um, but yeah, really nice um, gloves, fitting really perfectly. Um, just continuing on here, um, they also have a, reinfor a reinforced thumb panel for added durability. Um, as you can see here, the material is sort of double stitched here. Um, that's because obviously your thumb, you're using your thumb a lot, you're using your index finger a lot, so all these areas are, are really um, are reinforced just to make your comfort look that much better. Um, also, of course, they have reinforced fingertip panels in high wear areas, so that's obviously over here at the top. Really, really beautiful gloves. Um, great thing about these is that they're really low cost. As I said before, I got them from farsupport.co.uk for around £18, um, plus delivery. Um, they're an airsoft, quite a big airsoft shop, so if you want to order stuff, I recommend you get quite a lot of stuff from there. Um, these are really low profile as well, there's nothing big, no, no big uh, hard knuckles. All they have is this tan material, which is a coyote uh, material. If I get close up here, you should be able to see the uh, material. You can see it's really, really well stitched. Um, all it has is a Mechanics logo all over it. Then, of course, the rubber stamp say Mechanics, the originals, or the original. And all we've got on the, we've um, got a tag here, Mechanics, and on the inside you have the uh, information. Uh, simply um, made, you know, warning, not, it's not flame proof. Um, that's a slight downer. But, of course, you know, I don't think many gloves are flame proof. So all in all, um, I give these around, I don't know, I'd say an 8 out of 10. Um, I bought these to go along with my DevGuru loadout. Um, if you want to see more um, DevGuru related um, reviews and a loadout kit eventually once I've got all my stuff in, please click the subscribe button. And also if you like this video, don't forget to like it. I'm also on Facebook and Twitter if you'd like to follow me or like my page. Um, I do a lot of um, talking about random things with honestly questions, but go ahead. Um, so thanks for watching, um, rate, comment, subscribe, and um, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.